Uh, Chris Janok here with uh, Insight Media. I'm here at uh, CinemaCon 2022 in the Pixel Works uh, booth. We're going to talk about motion grading. So this is a technology that allows you to uh, eliminate some of the judder and strobing and motion uh, artifacts, motion blur uh, that you'll see, especially with a high uh, a high dynamic range content. So um, uh, it, what they have here is actually a, a demonstration. I'll get into it a little bit closer here. Uh, so uh, and the, the first part of this clip, we're going to look at the Hobbit, the five armies. This is the original 24 frame uh, content that was shown in theaters. Uh, and this has this nice filmic look, uh, which is what uh, the content creators would normally uh, have wanted. Uh, so it's... Uh, it's typical of what uh, what you see in the movie today. Of course, The Hobbit was also screened in 48 frames per second. Uh, and and look at this scene here. So you see how it's, it juddered around his head there just a little bit here. You can see some of the judder in this and the motion blurring because of the, the high dynamic range of this content, the brightness of the display. Uh, and But when it sh was shown at uh, 48 frames, uh, you've got those extra frames. It smoothed out all the motion. So here is the uh, the 48 frame look here, uh, and it, it does look cleaner. It's it is cleaner uh, because you've got these extra frames in here. Uh, the issue here now is it does kind of have that soap opera look, or it looks more like a like a like a game at this point, uh, which is some people will like and some people won't like. So the true cut motion, and you can see that in that same scene there, that, that strobing in here, the motion artifacts and the strobing was is greatly reduced when you add those extra frames, uh, but you've lost that filmic look. Uh, true cut motion gives you the best of both. Oh, here we now have the, the, the true cut graded version. And again, it has it looks nice and clean. There's a lack of, of motion and judder, but it still has that filmic look. It's, it, and and this can be dialed in just exactly the way the, the content creator wants, uh, and that's kind of the beauty. And it doesn't. It, it, it's usually done in a post-production process, but it doesn't have to be. This can actually be done on a finished DCP as well. So at the very last minute, uh, you can fix your film before it goes out. Uh, Pixelworks is also working with uh, TV makers. Uh, they've already got a deal with TCL to uh, add the true cut motion to their uh, television platform. And in the theatrical space, they're working with a company called Pixel Logic. Uh, they are a service provider that does DCPs and other versions of, uh, of film distributions, uh, you know, home versions, iPad versions, mobile versions, uh, as well as all the, the uh, geographic versions of the film. And they can now do this true cut motion grading as a service on, on the films. So that's it. Christian Akia for Insight Media.